These here are a pack of P120 Antec ARGB case fans, and today I'm going to be doing a quick review on them. About three months ago, these were the absolute best value case fans you could get that still included ARGB functionality. And coming in at around 30 bucks for three, which is $10 per, it was a pretty good deal. However, now the price has been raised, and while the markup percentage for the three fan pack is not nearly as egregious as the markup for the single pack, it still really doesn't feel good especially knowing that you can just spend five extra dollars and get a significantly better fan with significantly better RGB, and that's assuming you care about that, and slightly better static pressure. Anyways, moving on, the fan's LEDs are powered with a three pin, five volt ARGB header, and the fan itself is powered by a four pin PWM header. In terms of the controller that comes with the three pack, it does have onboard memory, as you can see by this clip here. We are able to turn the power supply off, and then turn it back on and it remembers the mode that we had last on it. Chances are that if you're buying an RGB or an ARGB or a DRGB fan, you care about the lighting because it does cost a little extra to have that functionality and those LEDs in the fan. So if you were to buy one of these Antec fans, you probably care about the lighting. Therefore, I must bring it to your attention that the first fan I ordered had zero functioning LEDs as shown by this Amazon review and this refund that got processed by Amazon. They took the fan back, thankfully. There's no problem there. But the fact that that got past QC kind of goes to show that there probably is no QC for these fans. So if you care about the potential DOA rate, from my experience, it's about one in every five, which is not good odds. So far, I have ordered about 10 of these fans and two have had no functioning LEDs. So clearly there's no QC, something's wrong there already. Unfortunately for me, since I ordered three three packs and three one packs, I had the luxury of having to return one of the three packs in order to get a refund for one dead fan, which is annoying to say the least. In regards to the fan's longevity, I've been testing them at full speed. These fans are still kind of quiet, so that that's good. But they've survived in my rigs so far for the past three months without any sort of problems. If you don't clean your PC, these are hydraulic bearings, so if you don't clean your PC, dust will eventually make its way into the bearings and might prematurely wear on them or even just stop them from working, in which case you'll have to take them apart, re-lube them, and then put them back together. Overall, I can recommend the three packs, which come with a controller, but I can't recommend $20 for a single fan. Not with these fans. Their build quality is just not there, and you could get something significantly better build quality for just $5 more from Corsair, or any other notable fan manufacturer, honestly. Anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. If you have any ideas of what we should do next, leave a like and a comment. About three months ago, these were the absolute bit. <coughs> oh, I'm not putting that in.